the enterprises need 5G. The, the 4G, the latency is not low enough. The AGVs or the robots, when they move at a certain speed, so what the camera sees and, you know, uh, it, it takes certain time for the robot brain to, to process it. So if that time is relatively long, it could cause trouble when, when the ro robot is moving. So that's why we need 5G naturally, very super low latency. What the robot sees is, you know, almost what the, the CPU will process. So that will greatly uh, uh, increase the performance uh, of, of robots and, you know, uh, other applications in enterprise. AI on 5G is a very particular term. Uh, what we mean by that is software defined using wireless network, uh, specifically 5G network, to extend the power of AI from cloud, uh, from edge, to the end devices. For example, AGVs, um, connected cars, uh, and uh, all kinds of sensors uh, in the IoT network. 5G network itself has a lot of uh, parameters. For example, we have a, uh, a lot of base stations, we have a lot of users moving around in the network. So how to best deliver the wireless data, the packets and the service to such users, uh, we can use uh, the help of AI to characterize. Just for example, um, how we form uh, the wireless beams, because nowadays we use uh, massive MIMO, so a particular base station has a lot of antennas. So you can, you can point uh, various different beams to, to the particular user, but how to do it in the best way? So we can utilize the power of AI to help us to do that, to achieve the optimized delivery of uh, wireless energy or wireless data to a particular user. So for network operators, uh, the applications were primarily targeted uh, in two scenarios. A city like Singapore, uh, we have a very dense uh, population, and then uh, the need for AI uh, is uh, very heavy. So we can utilize the same computing resources in the data center and do two functions. One is AI, just like the, the current AI applications using the, a large amount of uh, servers, uh, and then uh, we use 5G to deliver the service. We work hard to make it easy for the enterprise to adopt such a, a modern and cutting edge solution. I think if we think about it, uh, technology, uh, especially advanced technology, we need to make it simple. And only when it's simple, the enterprises, we can have a wide adoption.